Welcome to Jam with Dr. Terry, where Jam stands for Jesus and me. I'm Dr. Terry, children's pastor for Faithful Central Bible Church. Children, this is the month that we're talking all month about love. That's right. Everyone wants to be loved, right? Here's a fun fact about love. Did you know that love isn't just about how you feel? It's about what you do. Love is an action word. We must show love, not just say the words or only expect others to show love to us. The word love is used in many ways. We love God. We love each other. We love our family and friends. And we love things all our stuff. Toys, games, TV shows, tablets, computers, bikes. We love it all. But love is more than just a word. It's more than just a feeling. In the Bible, in the book of 1 Corinthians chapter 13, it reveals that love is expressed in attitudes and actions. Most importantly, Understanding and practicing love is the key to knowing God. Although the whole chapter talks about love, today we're going to focus on just one verse. Verse 4, and it says this, Love is patient. Love is kind. It does not envy. It doesn't boast. It is not proud. That's two things that love is, patient and kind, and three things that love is not. It doesn't envy, not jealous. It doesn't boast, we don't have to brag. And love is not proud. We are not better than the next person. We are all God's children. And guess what? God is love. And if we say we love God, then we must love each other. And not just with our words, but with our actions. God showed us he loves us by sending his own son, Jesus, to die on the cross for our sins. So let's follow God's example by showing our love for others first by being patient. I know, I know, it's hard to wait. We want things right now. It's no fun to wait. But think about how God is patient with us. Sometimes we mess up and we make mistakes or we just don't do what he asks us to do. But he still loves us and is patient with us. We also must be kind. I know sometimes people are not kind to us, so we don't want to be kind back to them. But that's not what God expects. We must still be kind. Even when someone makes us angry, or they do, don't do what they say they're going to do, or sometimes they're just mean. I know it's hard, but we are still to be kind, just like God is kind to us. Children, this week, let's practice patience and kindness. Try smiling at others or excusing their faults and simply being friendly. It's awesome to love and to be loved. And it all begins with being patient and kind. Children, thank you so much for joining me today. Please like, share, and subscribe to our channel. I'm Dr. Terry, and I'll see you next time.